Research into a concept similar to the Hyperloop was conducted in the 1960s by an Ohio State professor, Dr. Gerald Gregorick. He looked into the plausibility of a high-speed transport in a controlled, low-pressure environment and faced a major problem, finding a way to overcome the immense wall of pressure at the front of the moving pod. Proposed solutions to this problem were simply limited by the material and the battery technologies at this time. A multidisciplinary capstone team at The Ohio State University has taken the challenge of continuing this research by finding new solutions to this problem. The idea of using air injectors to influence airflow has been used by corporations in testing engine intake designs. We looked into these systems and found ways we could use them to influence airflow in our own way. Bernoulli's principle demonstrates that air moving at a high velocity can create a low pressure gradient. The air injectors on the sides of our pod will create this gradient to force the flow to the sides of the pod and essentially avoid building massive pressure in the front of the craft. This method of flow control eliminates the need for an air compressing device and adds a new level of efficiency to our project. Rather than relying on large, heavy battery units on board, each pod's tank can be filled with compressed air to drive the injectors for each flight. Combining this concept with other various energy efficient features will ensure that the Hyperloop transportation system is the most efficient form of travel for the future.